In this session, we'll cover how to program a TFT park sequence. Basically, all the TFT monitors all work the same way with a park sequence. Um, basically, the first thing we need to remember is to make sure that we do not have power on to the monitor. So you can confirm that by making sure that this green light is not on. So we confirm it's not on, so let's go ahead and uh, get power to the monitor. Once we have power and the lights are stopped flashing, uh, we need to make sure that we go into that park routine and park program before, uh, before one minute has expired. So let's go ahead and press and hold park. Once you see the light flash, that means it's in program mode. Once you go into program mode, it basically looks for two operations to happen first. It needs to find hard stops on the vertical axis and a hard stop on the horizontal axis. So let's just go ahead and do horizontal first. We'll go to the right, found the hard stop. You can confirm that it did meet that hard stop by seeing the, the rapid flash. Let's go ahead and do the, the vertical, press up. Rapid flash, found that hard stop. Once those two points are confirmed, uh, now you can go ahead and move the monitor left and right, up and down, to basically find the final position that you want the monitor stored in once you're done with it and done with operations. So let's go ahead and tip the, uh, the front of the nozzle down. Say so we want to go ahead and park it at that at that location, we'll go ahead and press and release park. See it flash rapidly, that means it's programmed that point. And let's go ahead and move it to the left here. Like that point, go ahead and program that. Once you're happy with the locations, uh, go ahead and press and hold the park button down. Once you see the light go out, that means that that park program is stored and it's in memory. Um, no matter if you turn the truck off, you lose power, it doesn't matter. This park program will stay in the monitor forever until you program it again, which uh, we can go through that sequence uh, as we did when we, at the start of the video. Um, to go ahead and run the park program, just simply press and release the park button. It'll look for the horizontal hard stop. You'll notice that the nozzle's going into straight stream. It'll go into a vertical, found those two hard stops. Now it's going to look for the other two positions that we programmed. And that was the last position. It's done with the park routine, the light goes off, the program is complete. A couple things to remember, when you're programming your park sequence, make sure that you not end your park routine against a hard stop. The, uh, the electronics have a difficult uh, time telling the difference between a hard stop and a program location if those two points are in the same location. So make sure when you're ending your park routine that they're not at a hard stop. Move it off maybe a couple inches just to make sure that it can tell the difference between those two points.